Hello Trenicam viewers, welcome to a video that is going to answer the most commonly asked question to me, which is what are my PC specs? Well, I'm going to have them scrolling across the screen right now, as you can see them, and of uh, the specs that it took to make the original battle vids, uh, is the specs you're seeing right now, and uh, if you get a PC like that, you can do the battle vids, because that's what they were done on. The footage you're watching right now, remember them? Remember those classic battles? It was all done with that. Now, Skyrim will still fuck up when you muck around with it like I did, because um, it's not designed to do it, so it doesn't matter if your computer can handle a million people on screen, Skyrim can't. It's not designed to do it, so often if you spawn too many people they'll just stand there and won't move because the game doesn't know what to do with that many AI minds if you wanted to get a new computer that's more deadly and powerful here's the new specs written below right now uh, the new NVIDIA GeForce GTX 690 um, with 16 gigabyte RAM Corsair Dominator Platinum DDR3 yeah, you can get that from the people that sponsor this channel now, Ironside Computers. I'll leave a link in the description. There's always a link in the description for those guys. If you're going to get a PC from there, they make custom PCs, which is what you'd probably need to get. It's the cheapest way to get a rig like that. Still not very cheap, but it's the cheapest way. Uh, tell them Tyrannicon sent you if you go there and get one. But yeah. So from now on, if you see anybody asking me this stupid question, I'll direct them to this video for the answers. If you want to make your own crazy battle vids, this is how to do it. Of course, uh, don't expect it to run smoothly no matter how much of a monster rig you've got. But if you want the kind of beautiful graphics that you're seeing here with all of the... But don't forget, a lot of these beautiful graphics are also mods. Check out my Skyrim Ultra graphics video for the list of all the graphical mods that you can get that I use. And that's how you can make Skyrim look pretty if you're still playing it. Or it might make you want to play it again, seeing it the way it was really meant to be seen. Well, of course the first battle vid didn't have any graphic mods on it at all, it was just vanilla Skyrim. But the other ones all, no even the second one didn't either, but from then on they did I think. Another question I get asked a lot is, where am I from? Well, I'm from England. Can't you tell? And uh, I'm from the northwest of England. Near Manchester sort of way. And as I do this recording today, Margaret Thatcher is being uh, given a state funeral that they spent 10 million on, apparently. And up in the north, we weren't a big fan of Margaret Thatcher, to be honest. I remember, I remember how much my parents hated her when I was a kid. So I disagree with the whole funeral thing. I think she fucked this country up. And the mess it's in now is all thanks to largely to her. So I'm not a fan. And I don't agree there should have been a £10 million pound funeral. The family should have paid for the fucking funeral. So I'm pretty pissed off about that. But anyway, other questions that I've been asked is what's with your accent? It's all over the place. <laughs> That's on purpose. I put on the Hrothgar voice for no apparent reason out of nowhere. And then suddenly I'll put on a strange English voice that's very posh out of nowhere too. It's just the way I amuse myself. I don't like talking in my normal voice. People often, if I talk in my normal voice, which is like this, people often moan that it's boring or I sound like I'm depressed. Because <laughs> I have a naturally monotone fucking voice. So, uh, I'm not depressed. If it sound like I'm depressed, that's just my voice. So I'll put on other voices to sound a bit more enthusiastic. Because my normal voice doesn't sound like I am. When will the next battle vid be? That's another question that inundates me. Well, as I said in a previous commentary, uh, the battle vids were actually cancelled. I wasn't planning on doing it anymore because they were slowly doing less and less in views and... You know, you want to entertain as many people as possible with these videos, so I was doing the, you know, the Throthcast stuff's easier, and in a way was doing a bit better, so I had abandoned it, but, and I can't say too much at the minute because it's still being talked about, but there's um, something happening now where it looks like there will be at least two more um, coming soon, 
Now what they're gonna be um, remains to be seen. People keep pitching me ideas of what I should do, but it's not actually very hard to come up with battle vids. The problem is making the damn things. That's an, the execution of them is difficult, not the ideas. There's billions of ideas. So it may be a movie based one again, like 300. Um, but I don't want to say too much yet, but watch this space and you'll soon find out the information. And there'll be a new Skyrim series also coming out soon too, which will be quite interesting to see what you guys think of it. And I was pondering what you guys think about the idea of doing a kickboxing banana series on this channel. Um, which would be a bit like the Throthgar plays Skyrim stuff, except with just with banana on his own. But my worry is it'll get a bit repetitive because the guy can't do anything except say his name in various ways over and over. And then get in adventures, so I don't know if the joke is worth thin if I made a few of those or not. I mean, I'll probably do a one-off of it. Whether I'll do a series will depend, really. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I'm almost on 100,000 subscribers as this video is being done. I'm only a few hundred away, whatever it is. I want to thank for the support, guys. Um, it's a shame that they're not more active. I have that many subs, but uh, not many of them are active as far as uh, stuff that I do these days, which is a shame. I'm assuming the people who just came for, for battle vids and so forth. But uh, for those who do continue to support, though, regularly, you guys are stalwart heroes and a true cohesive unit. You should be proud of yourselves. And apparently they've announced now they're done with Skyrim. And they're going on to an unknown project, but we're all guessing it's Fallout 4. I hope to God it is, because Fallout 3 is my favorite game of this generation. And I could... F Fallout 4, if, it, if you can fuck with it like you can with Skyrim... Um, but with obviously even better graphics and stuff, it's going to be biblical. So yeah, hopefully some new, exciting, interesting things coming up for this channel. Certainly in the near future. And, uh, so watch this space, guys. Keep supporting the channel. Get more people to do it, too. And, uh, I'll see you soon in the next bit. Take it easy.